Hey y'all. It has been a minute. A long minute. But how are y'all doing? I miss doing this. If that helps. <laughs> Hello to my subscribers. Anybody that's new here. First time seeing me. My name is Tiffany. And I like doing reviews on things. I like cooking. Everyday things. So hopefully you stay in like this video. Or watch my other videos. Which they're from like nine months ago but we ain't count okay but um i'm gonna show y'all some of the things i got for christmas and that i bought that wasn't for christmas um lately i guess you would say um yeah so let's do that first i'm going to start with these headphones um i have been wearing them it's on it's new year's eve today so i got them my husband wouldn't let me open them until christmas day i wanted them before this so when i go to the gym but he wouldn't let me so i had to keep using my beats which i don't like using them because they they go on your ear but they like press against your ear and i i was like I, mm -mm, that hurt but these um you see they go around the entire ear so, oh, I need to charge them. They sit on 18%. But these go around your whole ear. So they just lay against your ear and cover it. Which that is way less painful than the beats squeezing my ear at the gym. Because I like to listen to music and stuff when I'm at the gym. I need some kind of noise so I don't hear clinking the whole time. Um, but yeah, I love these. I got the pink ones. Even though this looks, the case is orange. But my kids are up. And that's what y'all hear in the background. But yes, these are my AirPods Pro Max. My husband gave me cash to go figure out what I want because I guess he can figure out what I want with everything. But he did get the headphones on his own. And I don't know what else he got on his own. But oh, I forgot to show y'all my shoes. I think I put them in the closet. I got me a new Stanley cup. This was from my um, Secret Santa at work because I have my big pink one. But he got me the ombre <laughs> green one, which I love. This is a 30 ounce. Yeah, this is a 30 ounce, but I love it just as much as I love my pink. Um, if you're not a Stanley Cup person, which I know a lot of people don't like them because they're bulky. I used to think that, like, I used to be like, I ain't never getting no Stanley Cup. Da -da -da. When I got that pink one that I was hunting, looking for, I went all the way to Conroe to get it from Dick's. I've been in love with that cup since I got it. So this is my second one. And then today, Target had the pink and the red Valentine's Day ones come out. And my sister just was there. They out. So she's going to another Target, which she went to the wrong one. She's going to the Woodlands Target. I said, honey, it really ain't going to be out there. So I'm probably going to be out of luck on that one. But I'm going to try the one on the third with Starbucks. Hopefully, I get my hands on it. Now, so what I did get... Oh, I smudged it. God dog it. Smudged it. It ain't even as shiny no more. But I did get the Tory Burch Miller belt. It is reversible. And it's very... The only thing I would say I didn't know it would be this soft. Like... I know the Louis Vuitton one is made from the canvas and it's stiffer. And I guess I was expecting the same thing from this one. Um, but I do like it. I wore it last night when me and my husband went to dinner. But um, I do like it. To me, it's not too, like, bulky. So, I do like it. And it's reversible. So, you can wear it either the brown side or the black side. I'll be wearing it on both, depending on what I'm wearing that day. But, yes. Um, I bought this the other day because they have their 25% off sale. I don't know when it ends, um, but they have their sale going on right now. And I did just get another piece because my mother-in-law, my mother-in-law, now she got me a bag for Christmas. It did not come in time, but... 
I'm going to show, I'm going to insert a picture here or here, somewhere around here, um, of which one she got me. I tried to find the wallet to match that, that would fit it. I can't find it nowhere. The only place I had it was um, Satire, Satire, C-E-T-T-I-R-E, -T -T -E, but it was like 260 I ain't paying that for no little bitty wallet. So I was like, okay, I'll just get a different color and match it with it. So that's what I did. Um, I got the, it's the same style wallet. It's just a different color. It is the bifold Kira Chevron wallet. Um, I have not worn it yet because my bag didn't come in time because we went um, out of town for Christmas. So it didn't come in time, even though Tori Birch told her it would be promised by new, by Christmas Eve. And it wasn't. It didn't come till like three days after Christmas Eve. So then she mailed it to me and I should have had it on two day shipping, which it should have got here yesterday. It didn't. So now it's telling me it should be here by the third. So when I get it, I will unbox it and post like a little short here on YouTube so y'all can see it. And we're going to see if this wallet fits in there too. Um, but it should, because I looked at the bag in the store, which they only had one <clears throat> of that color. But this is her. This is the inside. I got it for, it was on sale for, focus, $139. And I paid like $112 with tax, so I got on a good deal. But this is... The back zip part, which I'm gonna put some cards in here, um, cause I have more than how many the card slots hold for, which they have one, two, three on each side, and then there is a cash slot. So yeah, I figured this is a nice size, cause I have my um the Louis Vuitton Victorine wallet. It's about the same size, so and I wear it with a lot of my bags. Um, but yeah. That's what I got to go with my bag. Um, another, oh my God. I never dropped this since I got it. That is terrible. Um, but no, we're going to go to the phone in a minute. Um, my phone ran out of memory. But I have an iPad Pro, which I love, love, love this thing. I have been using it since I got it. Um, it was hard trying to find a case that I liked for it, but I found this one at Target. Them cases, high. Okay, I know how much this thing costs, but but the thing that go on here, honey, $80? I was like, no. I didn't even get the Apple Pencil um, because it was $130 because I wanted the second generation. I said, I ain't paying that for no pen. I got an Amazon Pencil that had great reviews and it's on sale right now. It was like 20 something. I'll link it below. But this is my iPad, and I do love it. I plan on um, doing my budgeting for the year and everything in here. Um, I love this. is actually mine. I have not given it off to my kids like I did the last two or three iPads that I've gotten. Um, so this is actually mine. I did let them use it on the road trip on the way back home. But I've been doing good to keep it to myself. So. Um, I did get some pink vapor mats, but I don't have them in here with me. So I'll show a picture of those here. Um, they're in my closet light and I don't feel like going to get them out of there. Um, but that's everything I got for Christmas. I didn't really know what to get because it's like, I was buying stuff even before the holidays. And it's like, I just count all that as a Christmas gift too, I guess. Um, but that's all I got for Christmas. Now, my recent buys since then have been... Um, I wanted, I ain't buying no Chanel bag, y'all. I'm going to tell you that. Not yet. I ain't going to say never. But I wouldn't get one right now. But I did get um, a new brand that I don't have anything from. Which I'm sure plenty of you have heard about it. But I got a Kurt Geiger handbag which I love. I love, love, love this bag. I love that it's all black because I was going to get the one with the um, gold hardware, but 
someone had returned that one at Dillard's. So I was like, no, I want one. This one was wrapped in the paper. It was nice and new. The other one had like some scratches. I said, no, because I know leather is soft leather scratches like this. But I bought this one in, I think in like November, October. It's very cute. It has just two compartments. This is my Sarah Wallet. It fits very well. Um, it has like a card slot that here. My glasses and my keys and things are in here. I need to get a new one of these because y'all my little coloring came off. That's what I need to go buy. I need a six key. This is a four. But we ain't doing it right now. So um that is my Kirk Geiger bag that I bought. I do want to get the tan color one because this one is so cute. And it could be a crossbody, I think. I just I haven't done that yet. I just wear it. I guess it would be it. This ain't gonna be long enough for me to make no crossbody, honey. But I did I do wear it as a shoulder bag, so it fits me just fine. So it's not heavy or anything. Even though the, the chains sound clunky, they're not. It's not heavy. But that is one thing I bought for myself the last couple months. Um, and then I got a bag I have been wanting for years. She's pre-loved, but um, when I say years, I've been wanting this bag since it was probably like $1,600. And now today it's like twenty six hundred dollars. Yes, ma'am. So the bag I bought when I tell y'all, I was so obsessed with getting this purse. So obsessed with getting this bag. I've been wanting this bag for years. Years, 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 years. And for the life of me, I can't even think of the name of it right now. But I haven't worn this bag forever. Ever, ever, ever. Um, and now I have one. <laughs> she is so lovely. I've been wearing her almost every day since I bought her. And I got her, uh, I want to say November, like the middle of November. Um, but she's so pretty. Look at, look at that. Ain't no scratches on it. Look at that. Ain't no discoloration. Nothing. Look at that. I love this bag. Love it, love it, love it. I do have my strap on the inside. Um, I got a little Purell sanitizer. And a hair tie. But this is drop the pin. But this is the inside, which look at that. That is impeccable. Impeccable. What is the name of this bag? What is the name of this bag? <laughs> I'm thinking in my mind. Never fool. Pochette Mati. And I was thinking that in my head and I just didn't say it. Pochette <laughs> But look at it. Oh my gosh. I've been wanting this bag. For, I know. It's 2023. I know a good almost 10 years, if not 10 years. Or whenever it was. I finally own one. This is a forever bag. It will never leave. Ever, 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 ever. Ever. But, um. I got it very, very good. Very good. She looks very well. She was bought in May of 2022, I think. But yes, I love this bag, y'all. Love it, love it, love it. That's why I say, you know what? I don't need that much for Chris. I've got some stuff. I don't need no whole lot of lot of. Because I was getting, buying stuff and it wasn't in Christmas. Um... But yes, I am obsessed with this bag. Right now, I didn't wear it. My stuff is not in here now because I just transferred it to my Kurt Geiger bag yesterday when I went on date night. But she the one. 
she is the one um i think that is all for my past purchases um <clears throat> i am going to make my videos for 2024 i know i was gone for a long time but um i think i needed that time because i lost my dad in december of 22 it's like that was hard you know i was trying to press it stead and it's like i would not be able to do this you know but i'm better now you know you still heal it takes time which just like with everything but um yeah i've been doing fine i'm okay i hope y'all are doing well um we gonna bring in 2024 um seeing y'all more way more than what i did last year but i am better now i have been trying to do my little weight loss journey okay i'm down some pounds Working out is not for, for the light-hearted, I would say. I do live heavy, you know, trying to get my little, you know, you know, trying to Zeus it up, you know. But, um, yeah, I'm doing good. Um, the babies are doing good. The husband's doing great. Everybody's good. So, um, I was trying to plan what I'm going to be recording for next year besides meal preps, uh, reviews, workouts, um everyday life things that's going on you know as mothers um trying to become a good influencer a content creator all those things so we have i have a lot of goals and ambitions for 2024 that i want to achieve including this being one of them so i hope y'all have a great 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 happy new year be ready we going to do this. It's 2024. We got... Let me finish what I was saying before I run out of memory again. Um, <laughs> but we have goals, you know, for 2024. So I hope everyone's 2023 went as well as it could have. But now we got to step into 2024 bigger and better. So I hope y'all have a great holiday. Let's get this year started strong and finish it strong and prosper. So... I will see y'all in my next video. Have a great New Year's Eve. Y'all be safe. Have fun. I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye.